Okay, uh, we're gonna work with switch. Okay, so we will be using the Cisco packet tracer as usual. All right, so right here, uh, choose your networking devices because switch is a networking devices, but uh, choose a second one. All right, because the first one is router. All right, we do not want router, we want the switches. So once you have the switch, this will be your list of switch over here. Uh, okay, depending on which one you actually want. Okay, let's use this one. Okay. 32960 switch. Alright. So, well, if I want to configure this switch, I will just... Oh, sorry. Alright. I will just double click on it. Alright, so this is what the switch look like and i will go into the cli which is the command line uh, interface okay so power up everything done okay press return to get started okay press return and i get the prompt switch prompt okay now if i want to change the host name uh the feature is not here I need to first enable right so I need to enable it okay so en enable prompt change you can see that it now has a hash at the prompt but I still can't run it here because uh, changing of hostname require configuration so config space t okay so now i can config i can do configuration okay so you can see the switch name in front config followed by the hash all right now okay so how do i configure the hosting or how do i change the hosting from the default well uh, actually the command is hosting followed by a space followed by the name that you want to use all right so uh lim so the moment i hit enter you will see now lim which is me actually will be in the front at the at the prompt okay uh of course lim, lim is not a very nice name for a switch all right so maybe you can do host name let's say uh level two switch okay so you can say oh this is a level two switch maybe you have another switch for the ground floor or the first floor all right uh, or probably you have another switch in a certain department or a certain area in your facility okay all right so that is how you change the host name inside the cli but uh, i can also view this let me just go to the config is this is actually the hosting see that the hosting is actually right here uh, of course uh, most of us don't have a chance to use a gui interface for switch that is why we rely very heavily on the command line interface but why go into the trouble of changing the hosting well uh, unfortunately it was not very well covered in your material so i'll just uh, explain a little bit over here is that you very likely are going to have a number of switches okay you're gonna have a number of switches and having different host name right, for different switch right, will help you in troubleshooting next time right? so you can actually trace to oh this is the switch that has the problem right in a logical uh network itself so it actually will help in the future for network troubleshooting all right so simple just host name all right space followed by okay what you want to label it but make sure you are in the config key all right mode 